From ABC News, this is ABC World News Tonight. Good evening and thank you for joining us on this busy Saturday. I'm Cecilia Vega in for Tom Yamas. We begin tonight with that breaking news in the Bill Cosby sexual assault case. A hung jury, the judge declaring a mistrial after jurors made it clear they could not overcome their deadlock. No verdict on whether the man once known as America's dad drugged and molested Andrea Constan. But now from the DA, a promise to retry this case and soon. ABC's Lindsay Davis has been covering this story from the very beginning and she starts us off tonight from that Pennsylvania courthouse. Legendary comedian Bill Cosby walked out of court raising a triumphant hand, a free man for now. The man once known as America's dad, greeted by scorn and support, some chanting, free Bill. After more than 50 hours of deliberations, the jury of 12 hopelessly deadlocked. Seven men and five women, including two African Americans, unable to come to a unanimous decision. Cosby leaned back in his chair and closed his eyes. What was Mr. Cosby's reaction? Relief. Um, you know, 52 hours of having 12 perfect strangers deliberate on your fate um, has to be a strain the likes of which I can't even imagine. A Cosby representative read this scathing statement from Cosby's wife, Camille. How do I describe the judge? Overtly arrogant and collaborating with the district attorney. How do I describe the counsels for the accusers? Totally unethical. The district attorney immediately announcing plans to retry Cosby. Our plan is to, to move this case forward uh, as soon as possible. There are a lot of cases where you get a mistrial and the next time around, prosecutors are able to get a conviction. The woman at the heart of this case, Andrea Constant, claimed Cosby drugged and sexually assaulted her in 2004. Cosby claims the sexual encounter with Constant was consensual. Constant's attorney released this statement, saying in part, we are confident that these proceedings have given a voice to the many victims who felt powerless and silenced. For now, it's a brief reprieve for the 79-year-old, who by many accounts had already been deemed guilty in the court of public opinion after more than 50 women came forward accusing him of drugging and or sexual misconduct. While some have filed civil lawsuits, Constance is the only option for a criminal prosecution. For the other accusers, like Victoria Valentino, the statute of limitations has already run out. Oh, what is your message for Bill Cosby? <laughs> you're, on, you're not off the hook, buddy. And Lindsay joins us from outside the courthouse. Lindsay, we just heard the DA in your piece there vow to try this case again. Tonight, Bill Cosby remains out on bond, so how soon will he be back in court? Yes, Cecilia, out on bond and still charged with three counts of felony sexual assault. As for the timeline, the judge said that he would expect that it would happen within the next 120 days. It would be the same judge again, Cecilia. Okay, Lindsay, thank you.